Are web and app developer jobs really at risk in 2025? It might sound dramatic, but with the rise of AI tools like Perplexity Labs, building interactive dashboards, websites, apps is now possible with just your imagination and a simple prompt to no coding required. Today, I'll show you exactly how you can leverage this groundbreaking tool to create powerful projects in minutes. Getting started with Perplexity Labs after logging into your Perplexity account on the main dashboard? Here, you'll notice three primary features. First, the standard search tool, which gives you instant access to all the top AI models ChatGPT, Google, Gemini, Grok, and Claude Sonnet. Next is the deep research feature. This goes beyond basic search, providing you with in-depth reports. But the real star of the show is the labs feature. This is where your ideas are transformed into complete documents, slides, dashboards, and much more. Let me show you why labs is such a game changer. Project one, building a global temperature dashboard. Let's start by using labs to create an engaging dashboard that tracks global temperature trends over the last decade. I'll enter a prompt asking labs to analyze the increase in global temperatures from 2015 to 2025. Using reliable sources like NASA, while labs gets to work which usually takes about 10 minutes it's worth noting how transparent this process is. You can actually see labs gathering data from across the web, pulling from trusted sources in real time. This level of transparency is impressive and builds trust in the results. Now let's check out what Perplexity Labs has created for us. The dashboard is ready and it looks fantastic. We have an interactive analysis of temperature trends from 2015 to 2025. The dashboard highlights the current global anomaly. The warmest year on record 2024 and shows the average temperature changes over time. You can easily switch between monthly and yearly views to better understand the data. For example, you'll notice a dip in temperatures around 2018, followed by a sharp rise after 2021 possibly linked to post-pandemic effects. What's even more impressive is the ability to filter data by region. Want to compare Europe, Africa, Asia, or North America to the global average? Just select the region and the dashboard updates instantly. The blue line represents the global average, while the yellow line shows the selected continent's average. You can also toggle between land and ocean temperatures with a single click. The dashboard is incredibly interactive. And the best part is that everything here was built in under 10 minutes with zero coding required. The data updates dynamically, and if you want to do your own analysis, you can download the dataset directly. But honestly, with AI handling the heavy lifting, manual analysis becomes optional. If you'd like to explore this dashboard yourself, I'll include a public link in the description below, exploring the lab's interface beyond the dashboard. Perplexity Labs offers a wealth of features. You can download the app's code, review detailed research summaries, and dive into comprehensive graphs and reports. Labs doesn't just provide surface-level data, delivers deep research. Showing you the back-end process, including sources used, scripts run, and files generated. There's also an asset section, which is especially useful for more complex projects. Here you'll find all the supporting files and resources labs use to build your project. Occasionally, if a project is too complex, you might encounter an error. But most of the time, labs delivers everything you need. The step section is another highlight. It outlines the entire back-end process, detailing the sources followed, Python scripts executed, and files created. This transparency is invaluable for anyone who wants to understand how the AI arrived at its conclusions. Labs even includes an image generation feature. For our global temperature analysis, it provided relevant images and visualizations also generate custom images for your project needs, thanks to the integration of advanced AI models like ChatGPT.
Project 2. Creating an expense tracker app, let's move on to another project this time. Building a user-friendly expense tracker web application. I'll prompt labs to create a tool where users can add expenses by category, date, and amount. With descriptions. The app will also include automatic visualizations to help track spending. After a few minutes, our expense tracker interface is ready. It features tabs for total expenses, individual transactions, and average monthly spending. There's even a help section that explains each tab's purpose, right? Making the app accessible for everyone from students in Toronto to small business owners in Vancouver. Below, you'll find charts and graphs that break down your spending by category and over time. Hovering over the pie chart reveals exactly where your money is going, making budgeting straightforward and visual. The app also provides spending over time graphs, so you can track your financial habits by month or date. Okay, you can easily add or edit expenses, select categories like entertainment or healthcare, and see your data update in real time. If I increase my healthcare spending to $1,000, it's instantly reflected in the pie chart. This level of interactivity makes managing finances much more engaging. If you want to try the expense tracker yourself, I'll include a link in the description below. Exporting and sharing your projects, one of the most powerful features of Perplexity Labs is the ability to export your project's complete code. You can add this to your resume, GitHub, or personal portfolio, an invaluable asset for Canadian, tech professionals, students, or anyone looking to showcase their skills. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give the video a like and subscribe to Trend Pebbles for more deep dives into the latest. AI tools and innovations, let me know in the comments which new tools or topics you want to see next and I'll make it happen. Thanks for watching.